Hello all, let's talk about factory automation. In the today world, our customers need to build highly automated factories in the shortest possible time. And afterwards, when the factory is running, it needs to be monitored and maintained with a clear target. It's required first to have a full visibility about all the involved systems, mainly for performance analysis and optimizations, and second, to monitor the conditions and predict potential failures and to schedule maintenance. The goal is to have the best performance and minimum downtimes. In this video, we will take a look at the Digital Twin demo here behind me and I will underline few directions how ST addresses this technology and industrial automation in general. This demo is available thanks to our partnership with Siemens, who is a market leader in control technologies for automation. The system consists of three towers. The one on the right side is based on a model of a real automation system with a robotic arm, sensors, actuators and many other components. The middle one is a control tower where we can find various control systems from the broad range portfolio of Siemens products. And both towers are interconnected together with communication and power signals. Then finally, we have the third tower where the digital twin image is built up and visualized on the display. We are coming now to the point what's actually the digital twin and why we need it. To say it very simple, it's a virtual representation of real physical system, which is in the, this case the machine on the right side. The digital twin of the machine increases the quality of the system, it simplifies and improves the confidence of the complete engineering workflow. For instance, automation engineer can validate the control program step by step using various Siemens simulation tools. And that's why it reduces the commissioning time and accidents on site. Moreover, it can be integrated into the production environment faster and with less risks. The production process can be continuously monitored and optimized thanks to the high level of transparency and the standardized connection to the higher level IT systems or even to cloud. Such an advanced technology is possible thanks to digitalization and it became part of smart industry or industry 4.0. And this mega trend is something where ST put a high focus as well. We develop the best fitting semiconductor products thanks to our close cooperation with market leaders. Let me highlight several cases like our extensive range of STM32 microcontrollers and we are also entering microprocessor world. In this context, I would also underline our focus on safety. And this is another important subject growing uh, market field. We have an ecosystem enabling to meet SIL 2 or SIL 3 requirements according to the IEC 61500 standard and I talk about the Xcube STL package for functional safety. By the way, also our smart power products evolution follows the trend of safe automation. And this is visible also at our intelligent power switches and the latest products we introduced on the market. Another point is galvanic isolation. We have several galvanic isolation IPs integrated in our existing devices like power switches, gate drivers and isolated interfaces such as Sigma Delta converter, general purpose isolators and so on. And we are developing next generations. We have understood Industry 4.0 would not work without digitalization. But this brings more data to be communicated among the systems. And one example of such a digital communication extended to the lowest level in the automation architecture is IOLink standard. ST is member of IOLink consortium since it was established and offers several products for this field. Besides that, we enable wireless communication over different networks. And this includes also a new generation of high-speed transmission mission on short distances operating in 60 GHz frequency range. In any case, I will be pleased to meet you personally here on the booth and we can talk about many more subjects in details. Thank you for your attention.